So I can send you, yeah. but she did. She has been working on it. She just waited until he was done with the world championship. Okay. She didn't want to mess with the change with the counter hands. Half passes, strides. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. and you know for the show, okay, at home, I oh. if it's good, I need like 15 strides. Yeah. Then you go on the show and you ride those 15 strides and you're mostly good. Huh. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. It's calibration. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um. You said shoulder four, yeah. and you, uh, half, and half yeah, was. what is it? So shoulder width is on three um, tracks, yeah. So you have the right hind leg, left hind leg, right uh -huh. front leg, left front leg. Yeah. And your horse is bent. Your horse is bent from his head to tail in the length bending. Okay. And it goes in the shoulder, in the shoulder in. Shoulder four is on two tracks. Shoulder four is actually when you bring that left hind leg between the front legs. Ah, got it. I got yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, I can see it now. Yeah. yeah. It's a much okay. less, it's a less bending, but it's like, it's like when you do the small sit-ups. Yeah. Instead of the Crunches versus the full yeah. range. I got it. It's the small sit-up. Oh, it's, the is it forward. more training in terms of uh, developing musculature or? Yeah. Okay. As well, and it's also especially for the horses um, to find the, the inside hind leg. Yeah. yeah. That's how you make the inside the hind inside leg. Hind. Ah. Yeah. Oh wow. Drive the inside. Okay. Yeah. Wow. And you especially use that with young horses because yeah. young horses, are, by the nature, they are crooked. You know, they come already out of the mother's um, body, like crooked. Bent one way or the one other. Bent on the other, yeah. and that's why I start doing this. Thank you, Alvaro, yeah. Hi. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. That's why you have to, yeah. do that, um, to, make, to develop yeah, this thing. Yeah.